Franz Liszt was born on October 22, 1811, at the very moment when the great comet blazed most brilliantly in raiding Austria. His father Adam worked as a steward on the estate of Hungarian Prince Esterhazy. At the time, Haydn was then bandmaster to the prince. His mother, Anna, was a housekeeper. He was raised listening to an exotic gypsy melodies as a lullaby. Trained piano by his father at age six, and his idol was Beethoven. At his official debut at age nine, a group of wealthy benefactors offered to pay for his musical education in Vienna. Friends began studying under Czerny, who himself has been a student of Beethoven, lessons in composition from Salieri. Eleven-year-old genius made a sensational debut in Vienna. Beethoven, ascending the platform, he repeatedly kissed Franz. Adam became a manager for Franz, and the concert tour continued. But he suddenly died when Franz was only 15. He started to live with his mother in Paris and gave piano lessons. He had always made it a principle while he was playing his scales to have an encyclopedia open on the piano. In 1832, at the Paris Opera House, Liszt was so impressed by Paganini's talent on the violin that he decided to become the Paganini O Piano. For three years, he stopped appearing in public and practiced almost nonstop. He also wrote piano transcriptions of Paganini, including La Campanella. Soon, Liszt began a relationship with Countess Marie de Gold, who became his companion for 12 years. They traveled throughout Europe giving concerts. The couple had three children, including Cosima, who later became Wagner's wife. Always brought silent piano for practicing when he was on European concert tour. Liszt's playing raised the mood of audience to a level of mystical ecstasy. He became the first superstar in music. In 1847, he met Countess Caroline Wittgenstein in Russia, and they fell in love. Next year, Liszt settled at Weimar. Caroline left her family and came to Weimar. He wrote many masterpieces, including Liebestan No. 3. He also worked on raising public awareness as well as the personal profile of Wagner, who was exiled at the time. Caroline wished to marry Liszt, but that wish didn't come true over 14 years. Later, he made up his mind to enter holy orders, became a priest at 54. Always wearing a black vestment, he made regular journeys at Budapest, Weimar, and Rome, giving master classes in piano for free. He gave away much of his proceeds from concerts to charity in his life. When Ito Hirobumi, the first prime minister of Japan, was visiting Weimar, really impressed by 72 years old Liszt's performance, he longed for Liszt's concert in Japan. Liszt died on July 31st. 1886, with Kuzima by his side. He was 74.
All his life, he didn't have his own house. His preferred language was French. Loved Tuscan cigars, a ghoulish Hungarian stew, and cognac for dessert. He was an alien. An asteroid called List, found in 1988, was named after him. It was the moment that List, who was born on the night of Great Comet, became a star.